All right, welcome to the live show. Now today, we are talking about flexibility, and I will be showing you different stretches, different things, and I will be telling you exactly what muscles we are stretching out. So when you get on here, hit those likes, and I'm just going to start marching those legs before we stretch out all of our bodies here. So again, this is a live show. We will do this every single day for a while here. So again, make sure that you're tuning into these live events, interact, have fun, most importantly, because we are going to be benefiting our whole body here. So if you are on here, hit those likes one more time and we will get stretchy and bring this leg out. We're going to start stretching our hamstrings here. So I just want you to lightly reach on down. This leg should be completely straight. Again, we're stretching the back parts of our legs. So again, reaching towards that toe. If you can't get it, just reach as far as you can. Again, this is super important for the knees. One of the most important stretches we will do. So again, let's reach for that toe. Let's hold it here for three, two, one. And again, excellent job with that. Let's switch it to the other side here. Again, we're reaching on down. Keep this leg straight, as straight as you can. And just reach for that toe. You can bend your back, sit forward in your chair. And again, feel this stretch right through this hamstring behind the knees. Again, this is the most important stretch to take care of your knees. So again, stretch, stretch, stretch. Three, two, keep holding, and one. Excellent job. Now, let's just kind of crisscross these arms here for about five seconds, and we will take care of our upper backs, our necks, our whole upper body as well as our legs throughout the stretching routine. So again, follow Along with this, it's gonna make you feel great, whether it's morning time, night time, any time. This is a great time to stretch, to limber on up. But now, let's just pull this arm across the body here. Again, wiggle those fingers, get the blood pumping. Again, we're stretching our shoulder here, our tricep, our upper back. So again, wiggle those fingers and pull that arm across for three, two, one, excellent job. Let's switch it to the other side again. Pull this arm across, wiggle those fingers here. Again, really feeling this in your shoulders. You're gonna to wanna to sit up straight. This is gonna help with posture. And again, keep those fingers moving there to work that arthritis in your wrists and your hands. And we'll go three, two, one, and again, excellent job with that. Now moving back to the legs, what I want you to do is bring your leg out like this. I want you to follow along with me on this because I'm gonna inc increase your flexibility in about three seconds here. So again, reach down for that toe. Remember the point where you are right now. I want you to come on back, sit up nice and straight, squeeze your quad as tight as you can here for three, two, one, I want you to tap that leg, loosen it up a little bit. Now we're going to increase that flexibility by reaching further and further. Again, you should have went about this much further. I went about this. So again, as you do these stretches, you will get more flexible. And let's hold it here for three, two, one. Again, excellent job. I got all sorts of tips to teach you on how to increase your flexibility, your balance, just like that. So again, stay tuned for these lessons. Let's bring this other leg straight. Let's reach as far as we can. Again, I can't quite get to my toe right here. I'm stretching, stretching. You might be in the same place. Remember where you were. Bring it back. Sit up straight. Tighten this quad as tight as you can. Hold it for three, two, one, let it loose, kind of tap that leg a few times. Let's see if we increase that flexibility. Let's go down, I got my toe. Hopefully you got a little further as well. Let's hold it for three, two, one. Excellent job with that, I'm so proud of you. So let's bring these arms up like this. We're gonna move it to the core and the middle back. We're just gonna lightly rotate here from side to side. Again, we're stretching our core. We're stretching our hips out here. We're stretching our obliques. Very important for range of motion. This is also a great stretch. If you want to continue to turn 
over your head as you're driving or doing anything that you have to turn and look back. Very important to stretch these muscles. Let's do this way one more time. And let's bring it this way one more time again. Excellent job with that again. Like I said, that stretch is meant so you can turn and look again. Whenever I'm in the car, I know I have to turn like that. And you have to practice your flexibility. So we will keep moving along here. Now let's work on some of our knee range of motion. I want you to grab onto this knee, sit up as straight as you can and lift your leg as high as you can. You'll feel stretches all sorts of places, but I also want you to roll that ankle. We're gonna take care of the whole body here and loosen it up so you feel great after the stretch, but let's switch that ankle and let's go the other direction around and around again. I can feel crackles in my ankle. That is normal. That means we're moving our joints, which is a great thing. So let's roll it for three, two, one, let's lift that leg up nice and high for three, two, and one. Excellent job switching to the other side. We're going to lift it all the way up, just holding it there, feeling the stretch. This is great to stretch out your hip, great for your knee range of motion. A lot of times when our knees hurt, it's because we don't have range of motion, so practice and start little. Start little just like this and build up over time. Let's roll that ankle in nice little circles here, around and around for three, two, one other direction, around and around for three, two, one, and excellent job. Let's move it back to the upper body. I wanna stretch out these triceps. So I want you to bring your elbow like this, place your hand like this, and just slightly lift that arm as high as you can comfortably. Again, we're working on those arms here. Backs of the arms are very important to keep flexible, so lift it up and hold it for three, two, one. Excellent job. Again, our triceps back here, which we just stretched, these are used for almost everything that we do from day to day. Opening, grabbing, doing all sorts of things, so we want to make sure that those are nice and limber. Let's switch to the other side right here. Grabbing on, let's lift that arm up, feeling that stretch here. And let's hold it again. Sit up straight. Let's hold it for three, two, one, and excellent job. Let's bring that back down. Now we got a couple stretches left here. I want you to bring your leg right up here. If you struggle to get your leg up this high, just straighten this leg and lift it as high as you can. But we are going to sit up nice and straight. I want you to take a deep breath in. Exhale and feel that stretch. Pull that leg comfortably. You'll feel this in your glutes, your hips, your uh, knees, all throughout your legs. So again, just feel that stretch. It feels so good. And we'll go three, two, one. Excellent job. Again, this is probably the most important stretch for overall range of motion. So let's do this other side. This stretch will help you take the stairs easier. It'll help you do all sorts of different things of walking around and moving. So with that, sitting up nice and straight, I want you to take a deep breath in. Exhale and pull that leg. Feel the stretch. This is, again, my favorite stretch because I know how much benefit comes from it. So again, feel it, pull it, and three, two, one, and again, excellent job. Let's return that leg just like this. Let's sit up straight. Let's just kind of crisscross those arms one more time to loosen up our upper back. And we'll go three, two, one. And again, excellent job. Let's just fling these arms like this. Again, this is getting the blood flowing to those shoulders. Again, if you are ever tense, you carry stress in your shoulders or your neck. These are great for that, but let's keep flinging those arms here for three, two, one. And I want to do one more time with these hamstrings because I know how important they are. Now, let's just simply keep this leg straight. Let's reach on down, reach as far as you can comfortably. And we'll go three, two, excellent job, one. Sitting up nice and straight, switch it over to the other side. Let's reach on down as far as we can. 
holding it, keeping this leg straight, feeling it behind your knee. And we'll hold it for three, two, one, and again, excellent job with that stretch routine. Now it's gonna leave you feeling refreshed, relaxed, loose, limber, and you can do it morning time, daytime, nighttime. I recommend stretching multiple times throughout the day. Now, in the description, I want to help you and you can help yourself to get more routines like this because we practice stretching in every single workout routine that I have. And I wanna give you something super, super special. It's called the Free Senior Fitness Challenge and you can click the link in the description and you will learn all about it. Again, this program is free to jumpstart your health, to increase your flexibility, your balance. If you have knee pain, this is an excellent starting point. This challenge is changing lives every single day and I don't want you to miss out on that opportunity. So again, if any members from Grow Young Fitness are on here, leave your comments below. Again, anybody can leave your comments if you have any questions, you wanna share anything, you wanna share anything whatsoever, leave it in the comments below. Again, let me see a bunch of likes here come across that screen, always makes me feel good to be helping you out. Again, with those stretches that we did, again, when we were doing this, we're stretching the hamstring. This is perfect to take care of your knees. When we did this, we're stretching out kind of right through here, the backs of our hamstrings, our hip muscles, our glutes, and we're also increasing this range of motion. If you have knee pain, more than likely it's caused by the lack of range of motion or you're putting too much stress and you need to build some strength, you need to get that flexibility in check. And when those things are in order, pain just starts to kind of go away. It's amazing and I'm just amazed every single time um, someone tells me, you know, I've been suffering for knee pain for five years and I tried your exercises, I tried the free challenge and magically, voila, it was gone again. This is the truth, I'm not lying about this. People say this every single day to me, how much their knees, their hips, their shoulders, their back, how much better it feels when they exercise. And again, you know the truth, exercise is the answer for so many different things. Again, in this free senior fitness challenge is going to help you with your balance, strength, your flexibility. I even have some cardio workouts in there that you can burn some calories yoga to stretch your body and work on your breathing, all sorts of great things in there. And you can click the link in the description to sign up completely for free. Again, I just want to thank you all for coming on here today. Be sure to like this page because like I said in the beginning, I'm going to be doing live events every single day here for a long time. So I just want to help you out um, and show you just how simple and effective just little exercises here and there can do. That stretching routine was five minutes. Imagine if you did 30 minutes a couple times a week, how great you will feel. Again, I promise you, you are going to be feeling on top of the world. You sign up for this challenge. Again, I just want to thank you for coming on here today. And as always, remember to keep it moving.